Welcome to Dungeon Keeper 2 Single Player. Start of a new campaign. Am I sure? Yes, I'm sure. And here's the first key, first world to go. Smiles, Phil. Welcome, Keeper. Before you lies a happy and carefree realm. The local champion, Lord Antonius, holds the first portal gem you require. Learn how to construct a dungeon, and build up your forces so that you can crush Lord Antonius and wipe the smile from his face. Okay, here we go. Behold, your dungeon heart. Protect it well, for if it is destroyed, you will be banished forever from this land. Here walks the goodly Lord Antonius. Tis he who holds the precious portal gem. But only when you've mustered strength sufficient should you challenge him and claim your prize. Lair. Hatchery. First, there's money to be made. Click on the flashing seam of gold. Your imps will dig out the area you designate. Ah, you picked a creature up. To drop him, right-click anywhere on your land. A slap. To administer another, right click on any of your creatures, then watch. They'll toil a little faster, but also suffer modest injury. Well done. And now your faithful servant imps will carry back your gold to Dungeon Heart. Once here, it can be spent. The golden scale atop the screen keeps track of your reserves. A start indeed, but more gold is required. 12,000 units should be mine. Red flowers float above your imps. These give measure to their health. Their skill acquired and reflect the simple thoughts within.
Excellent work, Keeper. You are ready to recruit more creatures to your cause. See? A portal near your dungeon hut to where your imps must dig. They'll claim this portal to be yours. You'll see what beasts emerge. Your dungeon heart is full of gold. No more than 16,000 can it hold. The lair, a place of rest where creatures sleep to calm their tempers and restore their health. Behold your portal, the gate through which new creatures enter your domain, drawn forth to use the rooms which you provide. A place where creatures feed on favored food. Look well. A goblin has entered your domain. On his own, he is a cowardly beast, but in a horde becomes a useful fighting force. Your goblins need a lair where they shall sleep. Tag the flashing area to guide your imps to dig sufficient space. Claim the land first <coughs> before I can use it. <coughs> 